are now available on Tata Sky channel number 526. Let's start uh, with our first uh, que uh, first question. We have uh, Yasin who's called in from ba Bengaluru. Okay. Uh, Yasin, how can we help you? Yeah, yeah, please. I want some clarification. Yes. If, uh, if uh, there are two brothers as co-applicants and co-owners of a property, right, mm -hmm. or which they have taken a home loan of rupees one crore eight nine point five zero, right, and are paying EMI of rupees one lakh, right, what tax benefit they will get individually, so right. far as repayment of loan and uh, this interest they are on is concerned, right. Right. Okay, so, so yes, what I understand your question know, that you right. are two brothers, both yeah. of them have taken loan independently and invested in a flat. They have which jointly is joined... taken a loan. They have jointly taken loan. Right. They are co-owners. Right. Joint having uh, joint account. Right. So they are uh, paying nine point five percent interest and right. EMI is one lakh rupees. Right. What tax is benefit they will get individually? I want to see. Okay. So, so see, in terms of the agreement, Yasin, if both of you are the owner and both of you are the taxpayer, and both of you are like examples, a 50-50% owner of the property, and both of you are going to kind of fund the, I would say, the loan or repay the loan out of your own earnings, uh, then uh, both of you can claim uh, the deduction which are available under the income tax law. There are two, I would say, the benefits that you would be entitled to. One benefit is like uh, the payment of the principal amount and the second one is in relation to the interest. As far as the principal amount is concerned, you are entitled to a deduction of up to 150,000 under Section 8IC of the Income Tax Act. And as far as the interest is concerned, you will be entitled to interest deduction under Section 24 of the Income Tax Act. Now, if it is a ready property, then obviously you'll be entitled immediately. But if it is like an under construction property, then you would be entitled to deduction of the interest under Section 24 over a period of five years after the house is constructed. So yeah, you have Jesh, two benefits. Uh, right, Yasin right had a very interesting question. He yes, also correct. said categorically that both of them are paying the EMI from a joint account. Right. Uh, now, in this case, uh, right. will both of them still continue to get the tax benefit? Since it's a joint account uh, that you're talking about. Yes, Kavita. Uh, see, the account being a separate account or a joint account, I think it's 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 not an important issue. It's just a substance over form. So in substance, if both of them are, I would say, paying the the EMI or the the I would say the uh, any other cost in relation to the purchase of the property and both of them are equal owner of that property, then yes, both of them are no, entitled. But, uh, but if they are like taking an example, joint owners and the entire property is being purchased by one brother, uh, funded by one brother, EMI is being paid by one brother into a joint account and the other brother is just only a kind of a joint owner and he is not paying anything out of his kind of own earnings, then obviously both will not be entitled. So, so are you saying both. that they have to show a paper trail, which is what I want to know, in a joint account, right. now the account is in both their names, right. you don't really know where the money is coming for, for right. into the joint account. Right. Do the brothers here in this particular case right. have to show that you know both of them are in fact depositing a specific sum of money on a monthly basis in that joint account yes. which is then going towards a home loan? Of course, because that paper trail is very important. Otherwise, how do you establish that the money which is going into the joint account is coming from two different people, right? So therefore, your question is very valid and concern is also very valid. It has to be demonstrated that both are funding the purchase of the property, it's only for the administrative convenience that there is a joint account. Wouldn't it be far more simpler from the tax perspective to have uh, two different accounts? Uh, I don't think that's going to matter anything. Unless if you are able to justify, then I don't think that's going to matter anything. Right, Yasin. So the answer is both the brothers can, in fact, uh, claim uh, tax benefits. However, you also have to ensure that there is a paper trail showing uh, that you know they are in fact both of them are uh, repaying the EMI. You can watch live TV on our website mbnow.in. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash magic bricks now. And don't forget to click the like button. You can also follow us on Twitter at magic bricks now. To stay updated with all our programming, hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel by logging on to youtube.com forward slash magic bricks now.